what is going on guys it's your boy Justin from the J Media and I'm back in another video so if you guys saw the last video you would have known I got a bunch of new car parts super excited um, I have import expo car show coming up in about a week so I'm getting my front bumper painted so right now we're gonna go to the body shop and check out the progress So here's my car if you guys are new to the channel my 2015 Mitsubishi Lancer GT so like I said front bumper this is the OEM front bumper that's coming off I'm really excited to see the new bumper he already painted it so uh, I'm gonna check it out he sent me a couple photos which I'll insert right here And if you look towards the back, it might look pretty plain. Uh, I had a wing on it, so I just took it off. So right now, I have a big various Euro GT wing in carbon fiber I'm putting on. Um, and also, this carbon fiber duct bill is a little faded, so I'm going to get Edder to, you know, re-clear coat it. So yeah, just waiting for him to arrive and check out the new front bumper. So Edder just got here in his beautiful BMW M2. And he's gonna shift out some cars so I can get my car in there and fit the bumper on. All right, first time seeing it right after this painted. Ooh, this thing looks classy and really good. So again, this is a various front bumper, and it does have a carbon fiber lip that will go on as well. So pretty stoked to see how it looks on the car. Alright, so now we have the front bumper out of the shop. It is safe to touch. So what we're going to do is we're going to take off the OEM front bumper and then get to slapping this on. Like I said, there's also a lip. So uh, should we slap on the lip first to this yeah, new bumper? Okay, so let me go grab the carbon fiber lip. We're going to slap it onto the front bumper first. Alright, so OEM front bumper is off. We had to take off a few stuff. So over here, there's this little metal bracket. Uh, we took it off the front bumper. We're gonna attach it onto the new front bumper. And then there are a couple stuff like these mesh grills that we had to put on since we took it off during paint. So we're gonna attach that. And then we also have this rubber thing right here we're gonna put up here that came from the OEM front bumper. And like I said, the carbon fiber front lip as well as this uh, kind of like a makeshift splitter. So we're gonna get all that put on as well. Gonna ride in Edder's M2. I've never been in an M2. I've been in an M3 and an M5, but not an M2. <laughs> so nice carbon fiber bits everywhere. Nice Alcantara. And it's a 2018? Yeah. Nice. What motor is in it? 3.0 turbo. 3.0 V6 turbo? Straight 6. Straight 6. Oh, yeah, you're right. BMW are straight 6. Uh, single or twins? Single turbo. Uh, I think it's called the N55. Okay, nice. The M2 competition comes with the S55, which is a 3.0 twin turbo. Okay, it has HP and torque there. <laughs> Gets a little tail happy. That thing is torquey. Seems like you gotta kind of rev it up uh, higher when the turbo kicks. Yeah. Around like 4,000 RPM or so, 35, 4,000. It's nice. So nice little ride along in the M2. This thing is torquey. And picked up a Milwaukee drill set. So pretty awesome. They had like a promotion going on. So there's a drill. Well, what really needed is a drill because my <laughs> Walmart special Black & Decker drill uh, just filled on us. So we have a drill as well as an impact. And it comes with a little uh, battery pack as well as a bag. So that's pretty awesome. All right, so this part is on, all these little vents are on. So right now we are going to drill to attach the carbon fiber lip onto the bumper. Uh, so if you have vice grips, use it. Otherwise, tape works just fine. Just line up both edges. And then what I'm going to do, they kind of have little like uh, indentations right here. So I could just drill through it. And they did provide self-tapping screws, but I'll probably use bolts, washers and nuts since those are more secure.
So right now we already went ahead and put the bolts on so I put uh, basically a, a bolt, a washer, let me focus here, bolt, washer and on the other end I have a washer and another bolt. So right now we are attaching this part with a splitter so we're using some tape to mock it up. I'm just going to use some self tapping screws. There's one piece in the middle and two pieces on the side. So this is where we're at right now. So as you can tell carbon fiber lip is on, bumper, just drilling this splitter right now. And it's going to have one more side on each to kind of protect the lip. Alright, so pretty much the splitter is on there. Um, right now, just moment of truth. So like I said, we had to get the front bumper painted. And then we mounted the carbon fiber lip. And then this little splitter to protect it. So right now, it's just going to go on the car. So right now we're in the process of putting it on the other side because I have a white body kit, uh, the white body fender, it doesn't fit 100% flush and like I said with any kind of body kit, aftermarket, especially aftermarket, OEM fits a little better but you try to finesse it and try to make it fit so that's what we're trying to do right now. Alright so front bumper is finally on, took a little bit of fitting to make it work. Uh, big thanks to Edward for helping me paint as well as you know fit it on. So right now we are Small little touch is gonna add these carbon fiber canards on and front bumper should be all set. So front bumper is all done. Again, huge thanks to Edder for his help with painting as well as fitting it on. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't and I'll catch you guys in the next video.